Hey YouTube, how are you? And to all my subscribers, thank you guys for tuning in again. Um, so someone commented uh, last week, they want me to check out this group called O3, OG3N. I hope I'm saying that right. It's OG3NE. Um, and they do this, uh, this thing called echoing. <laughs> well, I don't know why you're laughing, man. That's what it says, OG3NE. I think it's OGene. OGene? Yeah, with the E, it's supposed to be three, it's supposed to be an E. Yo, man. What? <laughs> He's like, uh, OG3. Alright, I, I want to make fun of somebody's right, name. Okay, okay. We gotta do this again. <laughs> hey, YouTube, how are you? So, someone commented last week um, at the one of the reaction videos that they wanted me to check out this group, OG3NE. I'm not sure how you pronounce that, but they do this technique called echoing. Um, and I want to check it out. So, you guys know that I do vocals as well, so I want to be able to check this out and. Hi, everyone. This is OG. In this video, OG. we'll explain our singing slash rapping technique. We call it echoing. It all started when we were kids uh, as a fun game. We would break down song lyrics word for word and assign them to one of us. We will start slow and we'll use a cheer and sing to demonstrate. Four, three, two. This love is a race that saw flames from the center of the stage And the fire brigade comes in a couple of days Until then we got nothing to say and nothing to know But something to drink and maybe something to smoke As we pick up the speed we try to blend it more to make it sound like it's one person singing or rapping Four, three, two This love is a race that saw flames from the center of the stage And the fire brigade comes in a couple of days Until then we got nothing to say and nothing to know But something to drink and maybe something to smoke Alright, let's speed it up Yeah! Four, this love is a race, it's all flames on the side of the stitch And the fire brigade comes in a couple of days Until then, we have nothing to say, nothing to know But something to drink and maybe something to smoke Let it go until I roll the chain Singing we found love in a local rave I don't really know what I'm supposed to say I can just figure it out and hope and pray I told him my best is nice to meet you And then at the end, while I walked in the tequila I already know he's a keeper Just like this was my day of kindness I'm in deep, if anybody finds out I'm meant to drive home by the drunk of love and down So where we're now, we just sit in the car with something that's you can check out our full wow. version of the song by clicking the link in the description. Wow. Enjoy! Well, big ups to that. And I had to stop this and speak to this because that is some talent right there. First of all, the harmony reminds me of Destiny Child. But they call it echoing. We call it counterpoint melody. So when I'm listening to this, I'm like, wow, well, it's just like counterpoint melody, right? So it's like one does something, one does something else. But it's, it's happening on the end of different beats. So it's great for timing. So if you guys are able to pick up this and check out their link, right? It's something fun to do because it's going to help you with your timing. It's also going to help you with becoming like one voice. So when you listen to groups like Clark Sisters and some other groups, they sing together so much that you can't really tell the difference of one person singing. So when you do an exercise like this and you're echoing and you're coming behind the other person, you also want to emulate how they sound, which is what these girls were able to do. So once again, it was great for voice placement because everybody's placement was in the mask. It was consistent. You didn't hear one person being loud and full voice. Someone else is being in falsetto. So the placement was all the same. They tried to emulate the sound of each other's voice. The timing was very, very good. So the faster they got, you know, they just kept the timing right there together, which is really, really good. And the harmony, the blend. I mean, so the faster you go, you have to just keep focusing on blend. So this technique that they're doing is really, really cool. Again, we call it counterpoint melody um, with harmony involved, with three-part harmony involved. But um, yeah, this is something very, very good to do. I'm kind of glad I got a chance to check this out. So subscribers, hit me up as you see, right? You send me something, I'm going to check it out and I'm going to comment on it and keep it moving forward. I'm looking for the opportunity very, very soon. So keep checking me out. I'm going to give vocal classes, right? So we'll be giving vocal classes soon. And in my vocal class, we're going to talk about everything from range to technique and to to diction, voice placement. It'd be a lot of cool stuff that'll get you ready for singing. It's not really about getting you ready to read music, right? That's cool too. But a lot of us are already doing shows and gigging, but we don't understand mic technique and things of that nature. So those are kind of things I hope to bring to you real, real soon. Don't forget, comment down below, hit the subscribe button if you haven't done that yet. And I hope to see you in the next video.